So guys, I already did my eyebrows. We're gonna go on to my Born This Way and use it as concealer. As you guys can tell, I didn't even do an intro. Like, what the fuck is going on with me, you guys? I'm gonna apologize right now because I haven't been posting as much and I really do that all the time and I always say that. And honestly, right now in this stage of my life, my mental health isn't okay. So I do apologize. But let's get into this video and y'all already know, Loka's gonna be okay. So I'm going to grab my Born This Way foundation in the shade Snow. I used to use Swan, but now I'm using Snow. Because I feel like since I'm doing tanning, I need a darker foundation. Let me know if I need a darker foundation than this one. Because I low-key feel like I need a little tint darker. I feel like this is too light for me. But let me know. We're going to hop in right into our Beverly Hills Anastasia. I totally said that wrong. I always say that wrong. But we're going to hop on and do our cream contour. And, you know, I do the top of my forehead and I do my cheekbones underneath my nose and I do it underneath my lip. You guys, if you put bronzer or anything dark underneath your lip, your bottom lip will have the effect that it's bigger. So, you know, beauty heck right there. Now we are going to hop on right into our concealer. And I am using the Maybelline concealer, you guys. This is not my favorite. I have a different favorite, but this is all that I can afford right now. So, you know, you girls still use Walmart brands. So don't feel bad. So. Well, after everything is done, I am going to go in with my Airspun. Airspun? I'm not sure if that's how you say it. But I'm using this one instead of my Derma Blend because this is just an everyday look. And I feel like my translucent Derma Blend is a little like expensive for this look you know you know now we're gonna go in with the palette called the magic mini by juvia's and we're gonna be using the color called kezi kez kesi i will put it on the screen honestly i don't know how to say it but if i said it right go girl you know and this is a literally a shade that's the same color as my skin the only reason why i am putting it on my lid so my lid looks smooth and I mean, there's still eyeshadow on my lid, but you barely could tell. So, you know, I'm gonna go in with my eyeliner. Honestly, I don't know what it's called. I think it's called Line Stiletto. It's by Maybelline New York, I'm pretty sure. But I'm going to be using that as my eyeliner. You guys, honestly, I wouldn't copy either. Um, it's like, it's just not for me, honestly. It's just, it's very hard to get some product out of it. You have to keep putting the top back on shaking it to get more product and i just felt like that's just not okay so if you guys see this eyeliner anywhere i suggest not to get it because it doesn't work as well for me went off camera and did my eyelashes now we're gonna go in with this fit me powder that's the same color as my foundation and i'm going to just set the rest of my face that i didn't set um because i did only just bake my face and as I do that, I'm going to be wiping off the setting powder that I had put on my face with the with my powder. So it just kind of all evens out. So there's no different type of tones, skin tones. Now we're going to go in with some bronzer. You guys know I use the same fucking palettes. I need to go to the store and give me a different palette because I feel like it's losing its color. I just feel like I'm putting powder on my face again. Like I just maybe it's just maybe it's just too damn old. <laughs> And you can't forget the bottom mascara. This is going to pop your eyes out. Because you can't have long top lashes without the bottom lashes being long as well. I mean, come on. just That's not okay. And then we're going to go in with this palette right here. The Aurora Anastasia Highlight Palette. And I'm using the color Luna to put in my inner corner. I love a light inner corner. I mean, who doesn't? And after that, I am just going to highlight the rest of my face. I do my cheekbones. I do my temples. The bridge of my lip. I do the bridge of my nose. I do my nose. The sides of my nose. You guys know we gotta blind these niggas. There is like no point. Period. Period. And of course, you can't forget the lippy. And I'm just doing something simple. Light pink. Something nudie and simple. After I did my baby hairs, I didn't really want to do anything else to my hair because I am doing this little like routine. Well, I'm trying to do like buying these products to make my hair grow. So if you guys want me to do a separate video on that, showing you what products I've been using 
for my hair to be growing to get more healthier let me know um i do see a little results not that much not the growth part but like the more healthy part so don't mind my hair today we are going to be reviewing after you guys seen this beautiful everyday look for me i know this might be not an everyday look for everybody but this is an everyday look for me it's simple um we're going to review these contact lens and um they are from iris beauty they sent me this little card this little card basically saying thank you for being an influencer they can't wait for me to review them you can find um their website on this card and you can find their social media right here as well everything else will be in the description below so don't worry so here's a little card it comes in this little box like this which is pretty cute and on the side, it tells you what it is. So it says expiration date, 13-11-2023. So that's pretty long. I've never had contacts that last more than six months. So that's pretty good. And maybe I'll do a second um, video on this once I hit six months because I've never heard of contact lens actually like last that long so we're gonna see um i did open the packaging yesterday because i was so excited to see what they look like but here once you open the package identical it looks like this so it comes with the contact case and it comes with your um right here it comes with the lens so this is the little thing that came with it and then it also came with instructions or on the packaging um i think everybody else knows how to put contact lens on but this is useful if somebody doesn't um and it's a lot of like warning stuff in here too like you know, i love that they gave me a little case to use because a lot of contacts just come with the contacts they don't come with a case for you to use all the time so you know that was good i'm actually going to put hand sanitizer on my hands and i'm gonna start with the left you guys i got them in gray and my eyes are not like super black but they're dark so we'll see how it like works before oh my god you guys um, there's a difference right how can i even like they are not even heavy i mean right now i can tell i have contacts in because obviously you can tell but i feel like later on i won't even bother me that much that i will forget i have contacts in because you know how sometimes when you hold it you can feel that weight of that contact even though it's not that much you can feel it i barely felt these i literally thought these were going to be so like clear that you could still see the brown and i was wrong like look at how clear that looks you would not think that it actually fit my eye and oh my goodness I am so shook. Hold on. You know when you have like a little bubble in your contact? Okay, I got it out. Holy shit, you guys. Look at these contacts. Yo, Iris Beauty. You did that, ma. You did that, ma. Oh my god, look at these contacts, you guys. You guys. <laughs> I don't even know what else to say about these contacts. They are fucking awesome. Also, what I didn't see on like each of these, I didn't notice that there was a left or right one. So to I guess it doesn't matter. Iris Beauty, I fuck with you guys so much. I cannot wait to take pictures like this. Like, so y'all did this. Y'all did it. So look. And they're not even like super gray, so I don't I look scary. They look like a natural gray. Okay. If you like these contacts, bitch, give it a thumbs up. It don't matter if you didn't like the video. If you like these contacts, give it a thumbs up, dude. 
I am so surprised. I I look like a bad bitch. Eh? If you like this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. If you're new to my crew, hit that subscribe button. I am I do a whole bunch of different shit. I review a whole bunch of different shit. So just stay tuned. If you fuck with my vibe, hit that subscribe button. Hit the bubble hit hit that bell button to get all the notifications every time I post a video. So you're never late on one. And again, if you fuck with these fucking yo if you fuck with these contacts go get them like they're super inexpensive also i have a discount down below so if you use that discount code you can definitely get a discount on your purchase obviously yo these are so huge yo. and if you're wondering where my lashes are from they're from my glam lashes um you can find them on ig right here i love their lashes especially their dramatic lashes like but these are double stacked. Again, give it a thumbs up. I see you guys next time.